So what are some of the things here that bring you the most amount of joy? Gosh. It is really overwhelming to actually be able to touch and walk around on and um, see with your own eyes things that you prayed for for a really long time. Um, I, I don't feel like I'll ever get over the fact that these ideas and dreams that the Lord put in our hearts we were so young and knew nothing. <laughs> we still don't know much. Um, that they are in front of my face today. That they're a reality and that He's built He has built this and that we got to be any part of it. Just the highest privilege. Um, to just to get to see it. And the fact that we did get to see it and see it really quickly in the grand scheme of things. Our God doesn't move fast. <laughs> um he is slow and steady, but he is faithful. And I feel like, um, yeah, it's just incredible to to be on our property and see the kids that we had no idea he would bring to us. But um, yeah, it's just incredible. Um, it's incredible to watch them play and not be looking over their shoulder, um, worried about things. It's incredible to watch them advance and every time we come down share something new that they've learned um, or a little victory that they had in school or in sports or something new that they're doing at church or a way that they're involved and that they're not just going but then they're turning around and serving within their body of believers. I mean it's just it's I don't ever get over it that um, and again just it is all a credit to God and his kindness and his goodness and and the amazing people that he has brought into our lives to to be on the front lines, um, all of our Peruvian leadership who worked so hard and to get to the, the honor of being friends with them and getting to come back time after time and hug their necks and um, check on them and see how they are. Little things to um, bring me incredible joy here. Like I think about, I love walking by the kitchen and hearing the cooks laugh. Like, it's one of my favorite things. It always has been. Um, I love watching kids, like, pick fruit off the trees and bring it to us to try. Um, I love watching them leave and then getting to greet them when they come home from school. Um, I love it hearing, Hermanani son, Hermanani son, around every corner. I mean, it's just, like, music. Yeah. So... I, I can find hope in the people in Peru who are doing the work the hand day out. I find hope in, in seeing the kids change slowly, um, small changes that happen, that, that happen over time that are hardly noticeable to others, but those who are intricately involved in their lives can see small change of maturation of growth and development. Uh, a spiritual understanding. Um, I find hope in um, in looking back to see where the Lord has provided always. I find hope in, in, in looking to the past and the struggles that we had and seeing how the Lord provided um, every time for what we, need, what we needed. Um, and I find hope in the Lord and His promises that we find in the Bible, where He says that I will not forget you. Behold, I've written you on the palm of my hand, and I find hope there.